21 Upcycled Lighting DIY Ideas Put those big empty detergent containers to use with this laundry detergent bottle lamp. No need to throw it away when you can transform it into this adorable lamp, perfect for a child's room. It's easier to put together than it looks and it's a great and fun way to go green at home. Stacy from Stars for Streetlights dipped into her vintage camera stash to make this stunning vintage camera lamp with slide shade from old projector slides. This do-it-yourself pepper grinder lamp with salvaged wood veneer shade is just fantastic. The creator made the base from a broken pepper grinder. That stripey looking stuff covering the shade is salvaged wood veneer. Even the socket, wiring, and other internal bits were scavenged from discarded lighting the owners found at the dump. Stars for Streetlights blogger Stacy's repurposed barn pulley pendant light is just as gorgeous as her vintage camera lamp. We especially like the exposed filament bulbs. And, we get a tiny peek at her kitchen. Here's another set of Stacy's Dining Area DIY Pulley Pendant Lights. This cluster of three hangs over the eat-in area of her kitchen. Vintage globes are hot, low-cost collectibles. We're not referring to fine, floor-standing antique globes you might find in the studies of old manor houses, but the mass-produced tabletop version produced for schoolroom and middle-class home use. You'll frequently find them for sale at yard sales, flea markets, and thrift stores. Old globes also make striking pendant lights. They're large and colorful and they add a playful vintage touch to your space. The process is pretty simple too. If you buy a bunch of old globes, you can hang an entire solar system above your head like this DIY globe pendant light. This charming lamp looks like it was made out of an old coffee percolator instead of a plain coffee pot. We think so because the piece the maker used as a final look like a see-through dome that sits on a percolator lid's top. Regardless, if you decide to make your own, either will work, percolator or coffee pot. We love these stacked rock lamps made by Philip Eberheim. Those are lamps our cat could not knock over or it appears so anyway. Being a glamorous gal is tough when your builder installs boring basic light fixtures. If you're not ready to replace yours, glam them up. The creator of this piece scavenged a cold cathode lamp from a scanner. We won't pretend to understand how he made it, but we do like the way it looks. Upcycling wine bottles as pendant lights isn't a new idea, but there's a reason people keep doing it. They do it because it's an inexpensive project and a fun look. This colorful mix of wine bottle pendant lights is especially pleasing and the exposed filament bulbs are an unexpected touch. Palm Wonderful Juice is wonderful for more than just drinking. Don't throw away your bottle when you're done use it to make this palm bottle table lamp. This DIY is part of a project series of ways you can transform a palm bottle into a creative lamp for your space including a mid-century modern lamp and a pendant lamp. That lampshade is ghastly and we're not in love with the tree trunk slice base, but we kind of like the idea of this tiny repurposed stirrup lamp. The folks at HomeSpot HQ featured this wacky upcycled paint can chandelier. We're not sure we'd want it in our formal dining room, but we can just see it hanging in a high ceiling artist's loft. It would also make a fun addition to a home studio, craft room, or child's bedroom. If you'd rather buy an upcycled lamp than making it yourself, there are plenty of sellers happy to oblige. You'll spot them for sale at craft shows, flea markets especially the artisan-focused markets such as Treasure Island Flea and Antique Malls. Who'd have thought the bits and pieces our forefathers scrapped when they updated would be so in demand today? The lamp on the right appears to be made from an architectural fragment. The amber-colored facing has a lovely luster, and we particularly like the stylized tulip relief. If you live a rustic or industrial-inspired space, these upcycled pulley wheel and fan blade lamps from Memphis-based Market Central should appeal. 
Vintage tea tins are so pretty you can usually find them at flea markets and thrift shops. For a project that costs next to nothing and is quick to do, you'll end up with a unique upcycled vintage tea tin pendant light that will add interest to any room in your home. This is the table lamp that inspired the entire DIY lighting ideas series. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos. And please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.